Let me show you how to make this simple tree ghost using only a few items. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Carrie with Scary Halloween, where we make Halloween props and decor on a budget. Okay, here's all we'll need for this simple project. One wire hanger, a little bit of chicken wire, some creepy cloth, I got that end of season clearance last year. Probably need three packs of it. I corpsed this skull last year and I have a DIY video for that that'll link as well. I'm gonna start with cutting this wire hanger from here to here. Using tin snips makes it easy. Next, you're gonna to wanna to poke a hole on the top of the skull and on the bottom. Now that our hole is poked, we're gonna put our wire hanger through it. Now that our wire hanger is through, our next step is to take a pair of pliers and start shaping this into a loop. Be sure to leave extra length of the wire hanger at the bottom. And here's an up close of the loop. Now we're going to start shaping the chicken wire to make shoulders. Okay, so I basically just ended up making a tube and then we're going to shape it more once we attach the head. All right, so now we're going to take our skull head and attach it to the chicken wire, kind of in the middle of how we made our tube. And we're gonna loop this around and back up so it's secured onto the chicken wire. Now you can see our loop through the chicken wire and we're gonna get this hung up so it'll be easier to work with. I'm gonna just start shaping his shoulders and bringing them down a bit so he looks less of a football player. the shoulders shaped down more the way I want them and we're gonna just throw on some creepy cloth. So I finished layering my cheesecloth and creepy cloth on my ghost and I think it looks great. Now I'm gonna show you a hack on how to hang this high in the tree. Start with taking your fish line and tying it around the loop and then keep it attached to the spool of fish line. Throw the spool of fish line over a branch, then raise the ghost to the desired height. I also tie fish line to the chicken wire at each shoulder, then to the tree to keep it from spinning. 